It's Saturday, the very first weekend of 2011. You're welcome to GSFM. I'm Jerry Sweeney, and thank you for tuning in today. It's the 8th of January. Lots of famous birthdays on this particular day. For instance, 1935, the king of rock and roll, Elvis Presley, was born. Shirley Bassey was born in 1937. Stephen Hawking in 1942. And if you're a David Bowie fan, I don't need to tell you that David Robert Jones, otherwise known as David Bowie, was born on the 8th of January in 1947. Well, yesterday we had our very first mystery voice of 2011. It didn't take long. It did not. This is the voice. I figure I can handle him. (laughs) I love the giggle at the end. Bernie O'Sullivan. She was given out when we were doing our three in a row or our beat the intros that she wasn't up early enough. Yeah. Well, she was up early enough yesterday because she was the first person to tell me that the voice was that of Joan Collins. We have a brand new one for you today. Are you ready? A nice, quiet voice she has to take a listen to this. Yeah, I do think we're good parents. Do you want to hear it again? All right, take a listen. Yeah, I do think we're good parents. Lovely. We've established that they're good parents. 1973 on this day. It's kind of coincidental because I was watching the movie All the President's Men uh, one particular evening over Christmas on television. Well, the trial opened on this day in 73 in Washington of seven men accused of bugging Democratic Party headquarters in Watergate apartment complex in Washington. So there we go. Our useless fact before I say goodbye to you, the most popular recipients of Valentine's cards are, in order, firstly, teachers. Secondly, children. And thirdly, mothers. Oh, useless fact for you. We're slipping up somewhere along the line, Valentine's. Jenny, that's only up the road. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow for Sunday's GSFM. More details on the extended one, hopefully then. See you soon. Bye-bye now.